Let's talk about oxidation, whitening, brightening, and stain mitigation. We'll take this piece of white carpet and apply blood. If you've ever tried to clean up blood, it's a pretty stubborn contaminant. And of course, the kind of thing as an organic that hydrogen peroxide has an affinity for. So we're going to apply a copious amount and then let's just make sure that it's good and in there. For anyone cleaning up organic material, the oxidation here is a great example of what you can expect, an example of how the product works to help remove stains of any organic nature. So I'll apply the APC. Pardon my penmanship. Oxidation, whitening, stain brightening is one of the tremendous advantages of a hydrogen peroxide based cleaner. But again, let's remember the APC, while only 8% hydrogen peroxide, is pH neutral and is not going to affect the uncontaminated areas and discolor them. Although always remember, carpet and other surfaces can vary tremendously, so test an inconspicuous area for color fastness first. Meanwhile, let's take a look at a different example which also demonstrates color fastness. In this particular case, this piece of decorative carpet has some great color differentials that we can take a look at. What's already been done here is I've, I've, I've obscured one of these roses again with some nice fresh blood. Now we'll use the APC and let it do its thing. So it's been about two minutes. Let's take a look at our samples. Here we have the rose, which was completely obscured with blood. And to give you an example of how quickly this works and the type of activity one gets through both effervescence and oxidation, you can see the reaction, which we just did on this piece here. Note, we did not change the color of the rose. Moving that aside, let's take a look at our white carpet, which was thoroughly saturated. And we can see where we sprayed the letters APC, how the hydrogen peroxide, and let's remember, it's not all about hydrogen peroxide. It's about superior chemistry blending hydrogen peroxide, proprietary surfactants, and stabilizers, how the APC went immediately to work on this blood stain. Moving this back, it will only take about a minute. But you can see the activity we're seeing here, this effervescence, is lifting and working on the discoloration of the contaminant without the corrosive effects of highly concentrated products that use acids to stabilize the pH resulting in a very corrosive product. Also it's important to note extremely highly concentrated hydrogen peroxide products generate a tremendous amount of heat, sometimes up to 250 degrees, which can have a deleterious effect on materials. In this case, we don't get that from the APC. A mild warmth is all I can feel.